as it was, I was a little gay kid with crossed eyes. I had crossed eyes when I was a kid. I wore an eye patch for eight years of my childhood. <laughs> eight years! So there's probably no reason I'm funny at all. There's not anything I had to distract anybody from. It's fine. When you're a little kid and you have an eye patch, they don't give you like a cool uh, black with a thing around the head, like a Johnny Depp sort of like a conquistador, like a hello. You're like, you don't get like a cool, like a walking the plank, like a pirate patch. When you're a little kid and you have an eye patch, you have to wear a flesh toned Band-Aid material, disposable eye patch. When you put it on your face, it just looks like more skin. It looks like sloth from the Goonies, but a little girl. And to sort of soften the blow of the patches, the company that made these patches, they put in the box with the patches, they put these stickers, because I think in their minds, they thought kids were gonna show up to school and just be like, oh, you've got a Lisa Frank iridescent pony on your trapper keeper? Well, I have a sticker on my patch. <laughs> but they didn't even make the right kind of stickers. They didn't even make the right, they didn't make like, a, like an iridescent pony or a square, like they, they made, they made, tiny, circular farm vignettes. A bucolic scene printed in only navy blue, tan, and brown. Like a little deer drinking from a brook, and then there was a silo and an owl. And you were supposed to take that sticker, pop it on your flesh flap, with your glasses, braces, bowl cut, and coonskin cap, Carrying the bow and arrows, you whittled yourself in a quiver made of felt. <laughs> to school and go and succeed at fourth grade. <laughs> Shit was rough. I turned out amazing. 